In a world first, a Victorian man has a new foot after a replica of his heel was made using a 3D printer. Len Chandler would have lost his leg to cancer until scientists and engineers combined to build him a new ankle. When Len was diagnosed with a very rare cancer in his heel, his doctors gave him the option to amputate below the knee or test run a brand new foot. I could have managed with the leg off, there's no worry about that, I'd be very glad to have it on though. For the first time, Len's surgeon, biotech company Anatomics and CSIRO engineers worked together to build him a new titanium heel using a 3D printer. We can take information from his other heel put it into the computer, the computer deciphers that, then helps us design and draw and ultimately build a perfect replica of the bone that we're taking out. The heel was built in layers, similar to how these 3D titanium bike parts were made. During Len's operation at St Vincent's Hospital, his prosthetic was implanted. He cut the right up there like that, and he just followed that piece around. Surgeons preserved Len's nerves, arteries and tendons. He wriggled his toes five days later. I've got no irritation or pain or anything from that. It just fits perfect, so um, I couldn't ask for anything better. Professor Chung is confident the success with Len's foot clears the way for other bones to be engineered in the future, including the pelvis, thigh, hip and shoulder. This is our dream of how we can engineer parts for people to bring out the best in function for them, uh, considering the ailments that they have. The human engineering project has given the grandfather of seven a newfound independence. I can drive the car, that's what I can most do. I can at least get around them without having someone else to be looking after me all the time. Karen O'Sullivan, 7 News. A whole new world.